What happens if a large leech is planted in a Solifugae terrarium? As soon as the leech is put into the Solifugae terrarium, the Solifugae immediately begins to look at the leech actively. In turn, leech calmly walks near our predator. As soon as Solifugae comes close, the leech begins the first attack. But unfortunately for the predator, it is tough to do this because the leech has a thick skin and can secrete mucus. The leech immediately defends itself by shrinking its size to seal itself. No matter how hard Solifugai tries to bite the leech, it does not succeed. After several attempts, the leech decides to break out of the predator's clutches and try to escape. But after some time, the leech decides to approach Solifugai again. In turn, Solifugai takes a fighting stance and tries to make one more strong blow to the leech. But again, everything is clear if you think that Solifugai gave up. It is not so. At last, she decides to make one more strong blow. She firmly grasps the leech and tries to bite and at the same time topple it. But the leech is very strong and our predator is defeated.